Right now, Pokemon Scarlet and Violet have been out for about three weeks, which has given everyone plenty of time to explore around Paldea at their own pace. This list will be directed at those who have finished the game, are still exploring the region, and to those who haven't got their copy yet. If there is anything that I've not covered in this video, make sure to put it down in the comments below, and I may put it on my next video. Without further ado, let's get into the list. The first thing you didn't know is a secret move related to the Pokemon Dondazo and Tatsugiri. If you enter a double battle using these two Pokemon, upon doing so, Tatsugiri will hop into Dondazo's mouth using its Commander ability. Depending on what type of Tatsugiri hops into Dondazo's mouth, it can either buff its attack stats, its defense stats, or its speed stat. This also gives a bonus to the move Order Up, which seems to slap the opponent in the face with a sushi board, serving three Tatsugiri. Number two, did you know you can transfer egg moves to another Pokemon? Let's say you want to give this Azumarill the egg move Belly Drum. First, you'll need to head to Kaskarafa, the water type gym town next to the desert. Head to the Deadly Bird Presence on the northern side of town and purchase an item called the Mirror Herb. You now need to give this Mirror Herb to the Pokemon you want to transfer the egg move over to. For example, I want to give this to my Azumarill because I want it to learn the move Belly Drum. Now we need to make sure our Azumarill has a space for a new move, so we're going to delete Misty Terrain here. Then we're going to start a picnic with Azumarill and another Pokemon who knows the egg move. Here I have a Hariyama who knows Belly Drum. After waiting for a few minutes, the egg move will transfer over. If you head to Alfornada, the psychic gym town, and look at the building next to the gym, it has some of the Generation 1 box party sprites planted all around it. If you head over to Mesagoza by one of the Pokeball flower beds in the west of the city, you'll find a guy next to two Pachirisu. He will check your Pokemon's size. If your Pokemon happens to be its biggest or smallest size, it will receive a special mark, which function the same as ribbons from previous games. Did you know you can gain access to other version exclusives when using the Union Circle? If you join a host who is playing on the opposite version to you, you'll have the opportunity to find their version exclusives in the overworld. But you have to be in close proximity to the player who is the opposite version to you. So this means you actually do not have to trade at all to complete this game's Pokedex if you wish, and also rids the need to buy both games for exclusives. For number six, we have disappointing news. Unlike Legends Arceus, there is no shiny Norzilla or overworld animation in this game. So when you're shiny hunting, make sure to be extra vigilant to ensure you don't miss out on any shinies. If you're in doubt, battle the Pokemon and a shiny animation and noise alert will occur. In Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, there are multiple methods to get Pokedex rewards. The first involves you opening your Pokedex app, pressing A, and then you'll see a trophy icon. Press X and you have access to a series of rewards. You can also go to Professor Jack's lab in the Pokedex Academy and he'll give you some rewards as well. As usual, when you complete the Pokedex, you'll receive the Shiny Charm, as well as a Diploma. Next is the Profile card. To access the Profile card, you need to go to your map, Press X and select Profile. This navigation is unusual for Pokemon games, and I know some people have missed it entirely. These are some cool things you can see, such as shiny Pokemon battled and take a profile photo, and an icon photo. The icon picture appears on the map and also in raid battle lobbies. There are links and references to Pokemon Legends Arceus and Scarlet and Violet. On the board, during history class, you can see Professor Laventon and the original Pokeball in Legends Arceus. There are also many links to Spanish history and culture. When in history class, your teacher refers to Paldea previously being ruled by a dictator. It's possible this is a reference to Francisco Franco, who was a Spanish general leading nationalist forces during the Spanish Civil War. There's also many Spanish dishes in the game, such as paella, but also they cook cloth in this game. If you do read many of the Pokedex entries, they refer to eating Pokemon actually a lot. That's my childhood ruined. In Porto Marinada, auctions will be taking place every single day. At the standard auction stands, there are many things which you can get which are on the screen right now, such as special type of Pokeballs, evolution items, and EV boosting items. What would be really fantastic is if you got a bottle cap or a golden bottle cap. Now, the store to the right where I'm standing right now will sometimes be empty. This is where the special auctions occur. Here, if you bring a particular Pokemon with you, such as Rotom, you'll be able to get the Rotom catalogue. There are also many other evolution items which can change the forms of Arceus, Hooper, the Weather Trio, and more. If you found out something new in this video, make sure to drop a like down below. And if you want some more Pokemon content, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Also, I'm always running a shiny giveaway. I'm currently giving away a shiny Fue Coco. To enter, just check out the instructions in the description below. Also, make sure to check out my streams, and I'll see you in the next one.